Hello everyone, and welcome to the latest Sumo News Roundup. Sumo Families is the theme of the day. Ex-Yokozuna Takanohana has been having rows with his son Yuichi in private and in public. Yuichi claims his father is a controlling drunkard who lashes out for no reason. Takanohana claims Yuichi is a lying Egid who needed firm restraining when recently trying to kick him. Each side, with the aid of the most sympathetic weekly magazine, has accused the other of distorting the truth, while Lunchtime TV has been having a field day. The only thing the two agree upon is that they're well past talking to each other. Disharmony is also rife in the Yoshikaze household. The current coach Nakamura is in the process of divorcing his wife of 13 years and retaining custody of their two children. Video, presumably shot to aid his case, has emerged of the wife screaming at her infant daughter and stabbing her eye with the medication bottle she was supposed to have broken. Coach Nakamura has confirmed the tape is genuine, but has withheld specific comment, saying, I just want to make sure my kids are in a better place mentally right now. Nakamura is also still in the process of suing his hometown in Oita Prefecture over the accident which forced his retirement. How much fighting can one man do? Thank goodness things are looking better for Terunofuji and his 26-year-old Mongolian wife Dorjiand, who held their official wedding ceremony on Thursday, three years after submitting the papers. The venue was Tomioka Hachimangu Shrine rich in sumo monuments, and really no stranger to family strife itself. It's also the same shrine which hosted the wedding ceremony of his coach, Isegahama, over 30 years ago. There are so many things you just can't do on your own, the Sekiwake said, and the support of those around me has been so important these past few years. And I'd say the person most central to my comeback has been my wife soon to be the wife of an Ozeki based on current form. Meanwhile, Takakesho's stable family has completed its final training session at the current Tokiwayama stable, prior to next week's move to Tokyo's Itabashi ward. It feels a bit sad to be leaving, but I want to do my best for the new stable setup, Takakesho said. He's been focused only on core exercises since resuming training last week, but hasn't ruled out an appearance at the group sessions starting on the 20th, saying, There's nothing better than making an early start on those practice bouts. And finally, Asanoyama's family at Takasago Stable is growing by one. Nihon Sports Science University sumo captain Takuma Ishizaki will be joining the stable after graduation this spring, with a view to debuting in May. Due to his third-placed finish in amateur nationals last year, Ishizaki will, like Asanoyama before him, be fast-tracked to the 100th rung of Division 4. He's also from the same Meitoku High School as Asashoryu and, indeed, the current coach Takasago, who says, Although Ishizaki is not the tallest at 173cm, his sumo really is amazing, and the future looks interesting.